This is freshman Congressman Jason Chaffetz. Let's make sure it works. The Utah Republican has a new office and a new home. They're one and the same. You can have a seat. You see it down. He'll live right here in his Capitol Hill think? office while his family stays in his Utah district. Uh, here's the cot. He arrived in Washington this week. Son Max helped unpack the car. The commute is short and the rent cheap, free to be exact, but the quarter's a little tight. I can save my family $1,500 a month by sleeping on a cot in my office. I can't believe it actually fits. Sleeping and working in the same place is nothing new for Chaffetz. His Utah home doubled as his campaign office when he knocked off a six-term incumbent. We worked hard out of our, out of our basement. We had no paid staff. Uh, we had all volunteers. We refused to go into debt. We were outspent by $600,000. Working out of your home is one thing. Living in your office is quite another. I don't want it to smell like he's living in his office. Everyone knows what I'm talking about. There's, you know, we don't want that to happen. So I may have to pack some really roll out of bed. air sanitizers or something in his bags. At least Chaffetz has access to a shower right, two so. flights down in the basement. It's not the country club everybody thinks it is, but it'll work. There's no real closet. He's hanging his suits here in this little hallway, which also doubles as his kitchen. This is the only place he has to store food. It may seem like a strange way to live, but at least 40 members of Congress live in their congressional offices while they're in Washington. Living in the office not only saves money, it also helps make a political point. Chaffetz promises to vote like a fiscal conservative and to live like one. Jonathan Carl, ABC News, Capitol Hill.